So here we go. But anyway, yeah, continue with the Beatles rock in. But if you have any songs you want me to do, like, I'm going to do the standard, like, Get Back, um, let's see, Get Back, Revolution, and some of their ones, like, um, Hard Day's Night, and stuff like that. Wow, sweet, I killed him. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I need to buy a combat tonic slot. Slot. Blah. I have enough for one. But I need to buy one. I need to experiment something with this uh, kick pad I have. Uh, not the the one that you've been seeing in my videos. That's a, like a white drum head, sort of like the the heads on my kit. But I actually have um. What the heck? I need the wrench jockey. <laughs> I need the wrench jockey. But um. Well, anyway, it's a bit of, uh, I cannot speak today, but, um, we had, um, I had a Simmons SD7K, yes, SD7K kit before this one, and we had it, and it was a good, and it, the only thing that was bad about it was, Oh crap. Oh, come on. Freaking bees. But, um, so I had a Simmons kit before this. No, wait, I need a physical uh, combat. So I had um, a Simmons kit before this, and it was a good kit. It's just that the kick trigger broke. So we sent a request in to Simmons to get it fixed. And you know what? We ended... Oh, crap. We ended up sending it back in. But then um, it turns out that we returned it and got the Elise's one because it was better. And so then we did that... So, wow, I'm totally failing at the story. So let me get the story right, okay. So then we t returned it, we turned it to Guitar Center, um, and then we got home, and then when we got back home, what was waiting for us in the mail was the replacement kick trigger. So we're like, okay, and so I emailed Simmons, and, and they never told us to return it, so we have an extra kick trigger now. So it broke again, even though I was using the felt side, and I was barely hitting it at all. Like, I would be, like, hitting it with my drumstick for fun. And it was just, like, like that. You can't even really hear it, I bet. And it just broke again, so we fixed it. And now I'm just going to play around with it. Like, mess it around with it. Mod it. <laughs> I need to find the enzymes. One more, one more. Got it. So that took me a while to tell that one little, like, slow story. Shoot. Oh, wait, I have, yeah, I have a grenade launcher. Oh, that's right, I can kill another big daddy for some money. You gotta be kidding me, that's all the damage it's doing to him.
Are you ever kidding me that that those two grenades didn't kill him? I am totally like failing at the research on this let's play part. But yeah, so far I've only had I've had one person guess twice and both of them are wrong. Where is he going? Seriously, I'm totally sucking at this game. Where's the big daddy body? Where's the big daddy body? Wow, I didn't notice that was there. <laughs> Fail? No. Oh yeah! Wow, I got a lot of money to spend now. The only thing that sucks about this game, and it's not really that major, like, they could have added this as maybe a, like, a downloadable feature that you pay for. It's buy, being able to, um, like, buy, is to be able to buy, you invent things, like, uh, shell casings, rubber hoses, steel screws. I should let you be able to buy those, or at least find them, like, stuck in the wall, or attach the wall, or something like that. And crap. But they should have let you be able to at least do that. But whatever. I didn't make the game. I just play it. And I enjoy it. So I have two minutes to get back to the larger Specter station. Ah, where's the bot to shut down panel? I gotta take pictures of these so then I can get the automatic hack for this. Cause if I get the automatic hack, that'll make it so much easier. Wow, I'm only on the third level. Let's try to hack this. Okay, I can go this way. I haven't hacked something in a while. I didn't want to do that crap. Shock you. Wow, that's like such an explosion frenzy right now. Here we go. End of part 